Hey everyone, I hope you guys are doing amazing. It's been a while since I've made a video. Of course, I may have had some clips floating around, but for the last three weeks, I haven't been broadcasting. I've been focusing on my health and then also building the World's Mayor Experience ecosystem. And we have made so much progress. Of course, not all of it is on the platform yet that you can see at www.joshuatbergland.com. And of course, that domain is going to change at some point soon. Um, but um, as I've taken a break to focus all of my energy on building out the platform, the team, working with mentees, working uh, with clients, and so on, um, I, I've realized that I haven't really made a video in a while. So I figured, oh, what the heck, I should jump on here and share with what's going on. Um, as of yesterday, we are going to be building, and this has always been part of the plan, it was just finding the right um, partnership to be able to do this. And the World's Mayor Experience virtual experience, meaning the what some would call metaverse, that experience um, we found the right partner for, and I'm not going to make an official announcement or any of that yet, except to say that the virtual experience side of the world's mayor experience that is to complement the world tour aspect of what we're doing, um, that came together yesterday. And it's all because of the amazing people that have been joining. And the difference between the world's mayor experience ecosystem and some of the others you've heard about it is it has nothing to do with me like yes my nickname is the world's mayor uh, the world's mayor experience is named after my nickname but the world's mayor has nothing to do with me uh, it's a mindset it's a philosophy it's it's a it's it's a way of being and if you think about what a mayor does they seek to elevate people they seek to be the to, to light the way for others to lead the ways to position people in areas of strength so that they can fulfill the mission. Or if you're working with a bunch of people and you elevate them into their areas of natural gifting and areas of where they're strong, you're able to move projects forward better because everyone's doing something they love to do and they're doing something where they feel strong, they feel good, they feel confident. And so this ecosystem is about helping everyone rise together. It's not about helping the, it's not about the community helping me rise. It's not about the community or the ecosystem making me famous. It has nothing to do with that. It has to do with all of us rising together. And so the people that are coming board, on board to the ecosystem, and we have some amazing, amazing educators, some amazing content creators. I mean, we are... The other thing that we're doing that's a little bit different with our ecosystem is that we're going to be more of a media organization than we are anything. So as opposed to hiding our ecosystem or making it where we're only elevating the leader, <laughs> something like that, it's not going to be like that. We're going to operate like a media organization, but a media organization for good. Media controls the narrative. And so... For so long, we've had the, the, the narratives that, well, we've had narratives used against us as opposed to lifting us up. We've had narratives being used to have us butt heads and get after it and fight and hate each other and go, ah, I don't want you in my life. No, that's not what this is. When I got into media, it was for the sole intention to take the, the organizations, the, 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 the small amount of organizations that fit into this pie graph, it was to take that and explode it into millions of pieces to redistribute the power that lies in the hands of a few and put it into the hands of millions. Because truth is how we're going to heal. Truth, truth doesn't just set us free. It doesn't just set others free. Truth heals. And we can heal our communities, we can heal our families, and we can heal the world with truth. And how do you do that? We use media. We use media to deliver absolute truth messages. Those absolute truth messages are our life experience. It's storytelling, how we overcame, the lessons we've learned from our life, 
the lessons we've learned from our career in corporate America, whatever it may be, it's storytelling. It's using our real life experience to provide value for others while also being able to tap into our God-given gifts and talents. It's a beautiful thing. So we're going to operate as a media company that seeks to elevate people, to raise vibration, whatever you want to say about it. But essentially, it's all about truth. And it's all about positioning people into areas of strength. So in the beginning of this, I talked about how this the, the one of the big breakthroughs that we've had is that we found the right partner to build the virtual world that goes with the world's mayor experience that's meant to complement the tour. Because the other aspect of what we're doing is creating a global humanitarian tour. Um, and I, all of the details of that, I'll save for now because I'm going to keep this video short. But it is a very exciting time. And so if you're looking for a group, an organization that wants to help, the, hold on, let me back that up. If you are looking for a community of people that want to see each other win just as bad as they want to see themselves win, you should contact me because we are all about creating win-win-wins for people. We are all about not just being a voice for the voiceless, not just elevating the voices for the voiceless. We are here to equip the voiceless so that they have a voice. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you're interested, hit me up. Have a blessed day, and I look forward to updating you again on some of the amazing things that are happening with the World's Mayor Experience platform. Have a blessed day. Thank you.